Hello and welcome ladies and gentlemen, my name is iCamera9, thank you for clicking on the video guys. In today's video we're going to be discussing about my top features that I want to see at Gamescom 2013, specifically in the Sony conference. But before we get straight into the video guys, if you're new to the channel and want to join the Saiyan army, be sure to click the subscribe button and don't forget to click the like button down below too, it really helps me out and shows that I'm making the great and entertaining videos for you guys to enjoy. So let's get straight back into the video guys, let's talk about my top things. Now first of all, the number one on the list is a given, a release date. Now I'm expecting sometime late or possibly really that's like a huge step to be mid-October. I'm really expecting Sony to blow out the wall saying that it's gonna come out, bam, here, October 27th or 21st is one of the rumored, rumored release dates. And the main reason I believe they're gonna do this is they really want to have that edge over the Xbox One. Because if you guys... The Xbox One has covered a lot of its ground. A lot of the things that we hated earlier are kind of fixed now and we can kind of get over that and they're pretty much evening the gap. I'm not saying the PlayStation 4 is miles ahead, but in my opinion it's way better. But second thing, I want to see Uncharted 4. Something to do with Naughty Dog. I don't care if it's Last of Us, a new IP, a new series that they've started. It's something I want to see from Naughty Dog and I hope, I hope to God that it's Uncharted 4. That game would be amazing to see. Now if this was a dream, I would also love to see Crash Bandicoot, but we can pretty much throw that out of the picture since Sony doesn't own the rights to it. I don't know what the hell they were doing with that, but unfortunately Crash Bandicoot I don't think will ever be returning to the Sony platform. Next thing guys I want to see is a user interface. I want to know what this bad boy looks like. It's going to be in my living room in a couple of months now, but I want to know how to use the user interface, how quick and responsive it's going to be. Sure we saw that little demo, but that isn't exactly what we're going to be playing or using it as. We want to see a real live demo up on the Sony stage. And next, what I want to see is all the different SKUs that Sony will be offering. They've already been teasing that we might be able to see some different versions of the PlayStation 4 sold to the public. Maybe not on day one, but maybe later in the year for Christmas time. I would like to see what I could possibly get if I decide to hold off. I want to see maybe uh, one with the PlayStation Eye, or one with a PlayStation Plus combo, one with a certain amount of games in the PlayStation Eye, or the PlayStation Move, so on. You know, show us what kind of options we have and what kind of price ranges we're going to have. Don't make it go over the Xbox One because then there's there's just no point for that. Keep it somewhere, maybe match it or keep it lower. But we're really, really cool if they managed to like maybe give a 100 gigabyte hard drive and sold it for $299. That would be a really, really big game changer and just give one more reason to buy the PlayStation 4. But I just I sincerely doubt that we ever would see a 299 PS4 this early, maybe like four years from now. And the next thing I want to see, possibly God of War, but just in general, a good solid game lineup. Show us lots of trailers from all the games we've seen right now, some new footage, everything to show us why PlayStation is the gaming console. Just express your amount of games from Gran Turismo to Infamous to Killzone to Battlefield to Assassin's Creed to Uncharted to Last of Us to God of War to Little Big Planet to everything that Sony can offer us. Just let us know. Show us this is what we got, this is what we want to give you, this is why you should buy the console. The more people buy this console, the more people play for PlayStation Plus, the better experience we're going to have. It's just an all around win-win situation. I can't get behind the Xbox One's reasonings for the Kinect or whatever you decide to use the Xbox One for, but I want a specific gaming console. And that is what PlayStation 4 is offering me and I want that to be expressed like crazy through this Gamescom demo here. So that's pretty much it guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Once again, join the Saiyan Army by clicking that subscribe button. We're going to hit 4 thousand subscribers any month now I believe we can do it before Grand Theft Auto 5 comes out if we could do that that would be amazing comment down below guys let me know what the number one thing is that you would love to see at this year's 2013 Gamescom for the PlayStation 4 demo and don't forget to click the like button and I'll be seeing you guys in the next video by the way there's some GT5 gameplay in the background peace everyone hopefully you enjoyed